In today's video, I will teach you how to cut out a subject from the background using Photoshop. Let's get started. First, open the image in Photoshop. Now, there are many ways to delete the background of an image in Photoshop. First is by using the Quick Selection tool, which works best in solid background, as it selects the areas that are similar to one another and you have more control over this method, but it is not as precise as the other methods. Once you've selected the background of the subject, simply press the Delete key and press Ctrl D to deselect. You can also use the eraser tool to erase the leftover edges that the quick selection tool had missed. Second is by using the pen tool. There are many pen tools in Photoshop, but I like to combine the regular pen tool and the curvature pen tool when cutting out the subject from the image as you can get really precise with the edges. But I would advise not to use this in more complex images such as trees as it would take a lot of time and patience to be precise with the edges. Once you've created a path around a subject, you can now right-click on the subject and make a selection. Then, press the Delete key and hit Ctrl D to deselect. Lastly, you can use the Subject Select option, which requires just a couple of clicks to delete the background of the image. To do so, click on the Select tab on the menu bar and select Subject. Now, with the subject selected, click on the Select tab once again and select Inverse or simply hold down shift Control i on your keyboard to select the background. Now, simply press Delete on your keyboard. If there are edges that the subject selection had missed, you can simply erase it using the Erase tool. And in case of the hair strands, click on the Select tab on the menu bar, click Subject, and in the toolbar, select Quick Selection tool and press Select and Mask. It will open up a new panel. And here, make sure to enable Decontaminate Color. And now, in the toolbar, click the Refined Edge brush and select the hair strands that you would like to retain. And once you're satisfied, you can now click OK. And there you go. You can now cut out your subject in Photoshop. If you found this video helpful, kindly like and subscribe. And if you want to see more tutorials, turn on the notification bell so that you can be updated whenever we upload new tutorials.